The story of Cynthia Kaufman is one that is both chilling and perplexing. A woman who went on a brutal killing spree with her boyfriend in the 1980s, Kaufman is now the longest-serving female inmate in California's history, with 30 years on death row. Her crimes were so heinous that they shocked the nation, and her trial became one of the most high-profile cases of the decade. But despite decades of appeals and legal wrangling, Kaufman remains on death row, and her story is one that continues to capture the public's imagination. In this video, we will take a deep dive into the never-ending death row story of mass murderer Cynthia Kaufman, exploring the details of her horrific crimes, her trial and conviction, and the ongoing legal battles that have kept her on death row for over three decades. In California, Cynthia Kaufman was born in 1962. She had a terrible upbringing which was characterized by a tense bond with her alcoholic mother. After dropping out of high school, Kaufman started using drugs and engaging in criminal activity. The wealthy daughter of a St. Louis businessman, Cynthia Kaufman was compelled to enter a loveless marriage after becoming pregnant at the age of 17. She and her boyfriend, James Gregory Marlowe, were detained for running a stop sign in Barstow, California on May 8th. 1986. 